Hello, Monsters about here, and welcome back to Total War Warhammer 3 and part 11 of my Kairos Fateweaver campaign, where we have conquered the Southern Wastes, and we now have control over some of the peninsula down here. We've got Dawn's Landing, the Southern Jungles, and we've also wiped out Zlatland, which means we don't have to longer have to worry about those bastards. So we just... What, now, what we need to do is we need to get Kairos and Locus over here. Little... Now, I... I think what I, I think what I need to do, we're creating some boys there. What we need to do is we need to get all of you lads, like, up here. And I want to try and, like, generate as much zinch corruption as possible to make my life a little bit easier. I'm tempted to send Kairos in this direction and uh, Thyrus in this direction, just because it's, they kind of split their empire in two. And I think this is probably going to be easier for Thyrus, and Kairos, of course, has a slightly better army. Uh, so that's my thinking anyway. I have done some upgrades of buildings and stuff, so we should hopefully be making a little bit more cash soon once those come online. I've also boosted up the magic in the southern jungles there, because we could just reduce all the rest of our provinces by one, and then increase that by, like, plus four, which instantly made that, you know, better, because we're getting more winds of magic, which is nice. Seen as, you know, our army, well... I mean, Zinch's armies are pretty good anyway, but when you just add it, you know, just unlimited magical power. It's pretty good, isn't it? Also, I do think Kairos's campaign being stuck down here. Oh, we've got a storm of fire. Arnheim pirates. Okay, not a problem for me then. Okay, you are just going to go down there. You're going to go down there. We have some money available to us. Speak with respect, or your corpse will feed my beasts. Noted. What if I... Goodness me, you're at war with a lot of people, aren't you? What if I... I really, I, I just, I mean, I don't really care if I'm at war with you guys. Rakath, why are you at war with everyone? You're at war with Marathi? You're at war with Nakari? You're at war with the High Elves? Like, you've... <laughs> I might, I might, you know, I'm obviously I want to, I want to stay friendly with him, but I do feel like maybe he's a little bit toxic. You know? Arcane Surge would... More spells, more quick. Sounds good to me. Right, little Rudiger. Tetanus. Actually, you know what I should do is check the old... Check the old name name suggestions. Let's have a look what we got. Anything good? Anything good? Merlin. Alright, sure. Well, not that guy. Not Isis, just because I like... I like the fact that Isis is running around. Uh, Merlin, the adjuster. He's always... And you think, oh, is it because, like, he's adjusting fates and shit? Nope. Nope. Just... He just often has his hands in his trousers, just doing a little jiggle. It's like... Just peeling... It, it, it away. You know... We all do it. Well... Not all of us. Um, so we're gonna go with more winds of magic. No, not more not more winds of magic. More more money is what we're going for. That's what we're going for. We're going for more money. And yes, we're doing this, we're doing this. We're getting the infrastructure in here. This is looking pretty good. 80 81 books a turn, plus the five. So we're getting 86 books a turn. That's not bad. We need 5,000 books, though, which is quite a lot of books, to be fair. Time has come for your faithful puppets to receive recompense for their obedience. The architect of fates will dip a great talent into the well of eternity and stir. You must first choose the outcome. Uh, twist their bodies. Okay, little Rudiger. Now, I was trying to work out what the 
what the better one of these two is. Now, from what... So, th this one gives you 50% reduction in infrastructure buildings and more growth. This one, on the other hand, gives you uh, corruption in adjacent provinces, which is pretty good, and recruitment cost reduction. So I genuinely don't know why you'd ever build the Dreadhold. The only bonus it gives is extra growth. And cost reduction on infrastructure buildings? That doesn't seem that good. Is that just me? Is that just me on that one? Uh, I would like another one of you boys. Uh, we do. Can we now? Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Should we just go, should we just go and do the 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 quest battle? Start for tomorrow. Let's go and do it. Fuck it. Oh, yeah, not yet. Fine. What does the staff of tomorrow do? More hero capacity for cultists. That's good. Recruit rank for cultists. Fine. Locals inch corruption. Okay. Miscast base chance. Fine. Staff of tomorrow. I mean, it's 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 not an amazing, but it's fine. It is. It's pretty much the only thing I can say about it. Is it's generally probably fine. It's hot Kairos on Kairos action. And we're going to move in and have a little uh, blue fire duel with our clone. Unfortunately for him, we're bringing a few more guys to fight. So we've got double Kairos. Yeah, more blue fire, more blue fire. This guy's only level 5 as well. Not that it really matters because, of course, you can't buff his health, but... But yeah, this, this this duel is is going south for Kairos pretty quickly. Oh no! Oh, he's down. He's down. He's down. Right now to deal with his army. Yeah. So in goes a gates. Got warp fire coming in. We've got the uh, whatever that one is. Gehenna's golden hounds. We've got the bombardment coming in as well. Absolute carnage. Unfortunately, enemy reinforcements are arriving from the rear, and it's yet another Kairos. Kairosception. With this one coming in from the rear, we quickly spin our pink horrors around to meet the new threats. And thankfully, we've got the Chaos Knights and uh, Weird Spawn here to, to deal with this. Luckily, they're just bringing a few units of uh, pink horrors, so not too bad. They do have, they'll bring a Soul Grinder as well, though. Pink Horus turning to meet the new threats, and we blast him with blue fire. And also, lock him in place! Ah, now you're just a giant target, future Kairos. He's a future Kairos, but he's also half the level of actual Kairos, so... Does, does he have a goatee? Is he from the Mirror Universe? Well, it doesn't matter. He's dead. Chaos Knights and Weird Spawn rampaging through the Pink Horrors. So much so that, I, you know what, we don't need our Pink Horrors. The Pink Horrors are going to turn back around to deal with the initial army. These Chaos Knights charging in. 
Getting a face full of warp fire. They don't like it up them. Jeez, it's down to half strength before they even manage to reach our line. And then they become terrified. I'm not entirely sure of what they were terrified of, though, to be honest. I'm a little bit confused about what they were... They suddenly fled from. Was it you? You don't... Do you cause terror? Well, you do cause terror. All right, fair enough. Well, it's kind of just a mop-up operation now with all the Kairoses apart from the ones that we don't want dead. Dead. The Exalted Flamer trying to move in to get some uh, warp fire off, but he gets a little bit too close. Too close for comfort. And... You know, too much of a good thing. Oh, it, ooh, ow, ooh, ooh, no, no, he's down. Boop. Boop. And the rest of the army, including the enemy Lord of Change, crashes to the ground. Bosh. Uh, we're fairly safe, so I'll take the cash. Didn't see... Oh, we got the bonus for beating ourselves. Cool. Spell resistance and winds of magic power capacity. And the staff of tomorrow. Nice. Kairos, Neatos. Uh, two skill points... Got all of that. Could do this. It may not be the worst choice. Uh, is there... Uh, let's see, again, the weapon strength for flamers. Just a weird fucking choice. Armor and missile resistance for chaos warriors? Yeah, alright, let's do that. I don't know. I, I'm assuming you must be a cultist, but I don't actually know. So in, uh, they really should have like something which goes just shows you what what uh, y you know. Like if you have like an ability which upgrades like a unit, it should show you what unit that is. I think that would be that would be good. I, the blue fire is actually really useful. We, we we have we have a lot of winds of magic to play around with. Oodles, oodles. I wish that was like a plus ten or something, or maybe it went five, ten, fifteen. And that that way, the more wizards you had in your army, the more spells that you could potentially cast. Because there is, I mean, you know, there is you get a certain number of wizards. You're just like oh, I don't need any more. It doesn't really help. And I think that is a bit of a shame. Oh, you can get all of these. Oh, but I kind of want... Okay, if we get the Watch... Warp Bane... Warp, bleh, bleh, bleh. Grumbling Horrors. Let's not say what that is. Replenishes ammunition. Um, okay, let's do something like that. Then we'll get rid of you guys. And I kind of want to get... These guys are tankier. We're doing something like that. And I'm, I'm really tempted to get rid of the, the weird spawn. Okay, you're going to be Stitch. That's what you're going to be. And we do have gems, but what it does is gives us... Gives us what sits. Not what sits, they're the cheesy things. Books. It gives us books. I want books, but not, not that desperately. 
not the not the pitiful number of books it gives us anyway. It's not that useful. Growth is useful. I, I guess I'm getting walls here. I guess. And more money. We have all of that. And I've spent everything. So we'll just have to wait. Uh, well, good. Right. Virus's army looking a little bit better. I want to get rid of these blue horrors. Maybe get some more pink horrors. Maybe get rid of the Chaos Furies. Um, I quite like... Well, mind you, they have proven to be quite good. They, see, they, they've got good melee attack, haven't they? 42 melee attack and the 44 weapon strength. They do melt at the drop of a hat, but they, they, can, they can really dish out the damage given half the chance. So I'm kind of tempted to, to keep them. I would love to be able to see how much corruption there is. You can't, because you can't see corruption unless there's actually some corruption in the province. It, does, it looks like Cetra's pushing, pushing what's his face back? Tic tac toe. Wait, what was that? Supernatural iridescent horrors. Recruit the chaos sorcerer. Can I recruit a Chaos Sorcerer? I can recruit a Chaos Sorcerer. Uh, Dark Fury. More charge bonus. Don't know if that's useful. Chaos Familiar. That... Could be useful. What do you get? Just a bot. You get, you get a War Shrine of Zinch. I want a War Shrine of Zinch. You do get these, but you get fireball, you get barrier replenishments. Uh, cooldown to spells is fine. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. Okay. So by recruiting a chaos sorcerer, we get better, better horrors. I, I'm not adverse to that. Do we have any more iridescent? Oh, we can get a couple. Strategists. I wouldn't mind someone, because none of that's useful. Um, I guess strategist is okay. Kind of want to put him in an army, so... Pink horror. Again, blue, blue flame. Pretty good. I think having the missile resistance is obviously quite useful. Because these lads do tend to, uh, to die pretty hard. What have we got here? Channeler, Keymaster, Intelligence. I mean, none of that stuff is bad. What, what can a cultist do? I get the feeling it's not very good. You know what? He can damage walls. Where to fucking gods? Okay. Okay. Right, we're doing some rejigging. We're doing some rejigging. Also, some more money making because that's always good. I mean, the, the more the more of the monument of potential. I mean, I, I, the, Zinch's agents are pretty good. The only thing is, we can only really assassinate people. The we can. I mean, all right. So these guys can assault a garrison and assassinate. The little Rudiger, the cultists, can theoretically knock down walls. I mean, obviously, if they don't, you know, don't blow themselves to kingdom come in the attempt, I guess. Never mind. These things happen. Hey, Krokgar. It's all right. I've got to kill you anyway. I 
I wonder if... If we switch this over... I'm going to switch that over because to be, I, I, I don't see the point in the other one, <laughs> basically. I don't think it's that useful. Stitch, I'm going to send you over to Tor Sapinda, basically to bolster that garrison just in case Krokgar comes down while we're busy. Now, I could, I could do some shenanigans, but I feel like if I do that, I, I'm trying to. I'm trying to save my books. I'm trying to save my books. I think we can reduce these. Bolster that. So we're keeping an eye on what's going on over here. I would like to see because you are at war with these guys. So where is the fighting happening? I feel like you've just taken Sun Tree Glades. Ah. Ooh. That's a nasty looking army. I would quite like to be friends with you. Barely you're heading the sands, but know that the desert is mine. Okay, he doesn't like me. He's not a fan. Which is fair. Stanic Devi De Deviance. Deviance? Income from all buildings. Plus five percent. I mean, we've, we do have a lot of increases in percentage to our money. And I feel like more more increases is only good. Because that means we'll be even richer. Oh, Harold. Harold from Neighbours. Who was the guy? And then he disappeared at the beach or something, wasn't it? And then he came back like years later. And he'd been in like the Salvation Army and lost his memory or something to Amnesia. Ah, oh, neighbours. Never change. I mean, you can't now, because you've been cancelled, so. I just thought of something. If you're up here, are you going to sail down? Oh, fuck. You know what? Just to be on the safe side. Just to be on the safe side. I think we're going to have to send... Can we maybe uh, transfer settlement to me? I could do that. I could do that. I could do that. It would cost me all my books. I'm trying to save books. That's the problem. Maybe, maybe if we spread enough... It, okay, Zinch Corruption is increasing here. And I'm not overly concerned about... about pissing... Uh, Tic-Tac-Toe off. So we're going to bolster that, because the more books we have, the better, right? Feel like we could maybe because like we got we got winds of magic right. So if I if I change this to more books, that's fifty percent more books. So we've got eight books there, and then no more, no more right? Uh, what about here? So we got three there. We got three there. We got eight there. That's not that many more books, is it? Realistically. Like I'm not I'm not I'm not excited by the number of books that I could potentially potentially give me. Okay, Thyrus, are you ready to go? Tell you what, can you go and grab this, whatever it is? It is uh sure, explore the islands. It's a bunch of dead guys. Oh, I'm sure we can just all resolve that. Let's take the money. That's it. Piss off. We get a scroll of stone. Okay, that's not bad. And materials at sea, so more cash. Not bad. Okay, now we've got some options here. So we have. Now I don't know why these are red and these are yellow. No idea. I also don't know how many 
uh, uses of it you get. It's a bound spell. It does have a cooldown. Transformation of Kadon? Hmm. Um... What do I think? What do I think? I quite like Comet of Cassandora. Amber Spear is an obvious one. Flamestorm's actually quite good. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go Comet. We're going to go Comet. We're going to get a Gate of Cinch. And, yeah. Because the more... The more Zinch corruption in a region, the cheaper it is to do Zinch shenanigans. So if we can increase the amount of Zinch corruption in that region, we can make it a lot cheaper. And my hope is we can just, like, without having to direct... Well, do we need to, do we need to worry about declaring... I want to try... Well, no, fuck it. We may as well declare war on tic tac -toe. Save me books, and then I can just take the fucking settlement off him. Especially if he's getting... If he's getting railed on by Setra. I mean, Setra may be a worry late in, in a minute. But for the moment, I think we can probably just not stress ourselves too much. Didn't you just claim it? Okay, I'm just nervous that we might get Krokgar sailing down, being the big eye. Oh, hello. Are you at war with... Okay, you are at war now. Oh, you're also at war with... Um, you are defensive allies with the last defenders. I let's just Isis get in there and stab someone. Good job. Good fucking job. Okay, I'm just gonna meander over here and do some light raiding. Okay, you're immortal, thanks. You can never leave us. But why would you want to? You don't want to. I quite like Plague of Rust because that is going... It, it is a useful, useful adornment. Did you not... What? What? The world will quail. Okay. Right, you're right. I think we're we're going to attack. We're gonna hit them two sides at the same time. Stitch is gonna act as like a, a local defense force just in case we need it. Because settlement garrisons are fucking useless. And we're going to upgrade all this shenanigans. It's going to be great. This is going to be great. And we get more cash. Yeah. And Harold is doing his thing. Uh, we want more money there. And ideally there. But we can't afford the more money there. So we're not going to worry too much about that. Did we have an agent who hasn't moved? Probably. But ha ha Harold's on the go. Just don't. Just don't go on a fishing trip, Harold. I am the Oracle. Skrulk, are you still around? You, still, you know what? Are you doing alright there, Rakarth? I'm a little bit worried about you. I mean, if worst comes to worst, we can recruit a force down here. Which is why I'm keeping some money in the bank. Just in case we suddenly need an army. Somewhere.
The cult of pleasure has fallen to the seduction. I mean, that was that was on the cards, wasn't it? That was going to happen. Okay. Okay. This the last defenders are up there. You're going back there. Now, do you just? Am I just going to have to give you a spell every single? Every single time. Is that is that your thing? We've got more money. Death and decay. Okay, so we're going to have some undead issues. Now, I'm already at war with the last defenders, so it really makes no difference to me. So we're just going to swoop in here, and you are... Yeah, we can just auto resolve that one. Grab that. Eternal blasphemy. Uh, you've got blade, shield, deadly blade. I could give you a little bit more armor. I'm kind of tempted Killing to do that. Get greater gate of zinch, which means we can summon in a greater demon, which sounds quite nice. Oh, that's that has stuck now. Good. Oh, we can get more, more grimoires per turn. Research rate, all that kind of good stuff. Excellent. I guess we'll stick with requisition. I have risen. Did we lose someone? Chaos needs ports. Okay, we'll get that one then. In the meantime, we swoop in and grab the Caverns of Sotek. Then we can take the Temple Avenue of Gold. And yes, I could be sacking settlements. I just think it's better to keep them relatively intact. That's my hot take. Fact is, I've got enough money that I can do a bunch of upgrades and not have to stress really about... Yeah, you go that way. Um, don't have to stress myself too much about then having to grow settlements and I feel like taking this at level 2 is better than taking a level 1. That's, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Uh, you guys could be a problem. I don't... I, I think TikTok... Now, I, I reckon these... You've got... You've got multiple other problems. You've got multiple other problems. The only other thing is that doesn't Manfred start around here somewhere? And if the undead decide to go off the deep ends... Could potentially cause us some issues. More... Oh, we've got more cash. Uh, Bolt of Change. I don't really care about Bolt of Change, to be honest. It's a bit meh. None of that. None of that. Or any of the others. Since fire stop. I guess... I guess I don't really care. Uh, if we go for, like, I don't know, Lord Recruit rank? This was required. Lord Recruit rank, sound good. And, right, we need to take out the last defenders. That'll give us the, the short victim. That gives us plus 30 Winds of Magic Power Reserve, which means basically, even in a region where we have no Winds of Magic, we will never have less than the maximum amount of Winds of Magic. Which is pretty great. And then we just need to loot, sack, or raise 80 different settlements. Because the box makers and the bubonic swarm. Where did the bubonic swarm even spawn? Where do they start? Do they start in the chaos waste somewhere? I don't think I've ever run into them. They must be like a minor faction that dies on like turn eight. What a what a weird. I don't know. Like, I know Nurgle's like the, you know, the main foil. The main... The main opponents of of Zinch. But you think maybe just go, you know, wipe out Nakari and... 
Like wipe out the other gods, right? Wipe out the other champion, the other the other gods' champions. That would kind of make more sense than kill this minor faction. That I genuinely can't even. I don't even know where they spawn. Oh, Rudiger's back. Fuck's sake, Rudiger. You you bet you better up your fucking game. Tremors from the jungle. Oh, that can't be good. Okay, so what have we got? Tremors from the jungle, death and decay. Uh, did we have dwarves? I genuinely can't remember. Genuinely can't remember. Good job, you. I think I just have to give them a skill point every... Maybe they just don't work as a character. I don't know. Who knows? Right, we'll build you. This will increase corruption across the region, which is good. I mean, I could just give me the Temple Avenue of Gold, but I think I just... I need to save books, don't I? I need to save the books. Save the books. I, I probably should upgrade the uh, the growth buildings. How much is that going to cost? That's not very much. How much growth do we have? Oh, we've actually got enough. We just need the money. Oh, shit. If I just save some... To be honest, that means I can knock that down. What does that even do? It's just it's just growth, isn't it? Yeah, I don't need that. I don't need you. Is it the same with you? It is. Right, so we don't need you. Or you. Uh, this one, probably not. No, it is the same. Holy shit. All right, get rid of you and you and you. And now if we can just, we can just get some cash together, we can upgrade everything to level, level five. Tomorrow. Bish bosh bash. Oh, arcane conduit. I mean, all of our pink horrors have arcane conduit. We... I'm not going to lie, the amount of Winds of Magic we pump out is is legitimately fucking insane. And almost a little bit filthy. Hello. Uh, right, if the lizard men spawn, and they will spawn. Now... Now, I don't... What I could do... Is actually untick the revived dead factions. Because if a faction's already dead, it's already it's, it's 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 quite annoying when a faction just pops into existence. I don't know if that's more annoying or is makes it more interesting. I I'm in two minds. I don't know. I'm gonna have to mull that one over. I think. Have a little mull. Oh, there's the dwarves. So text trail has the only the only problem is I guess I could build that, and it would set it to tempestuous, which would like fix that. But I could always just fix that now. It it's just kind of a waste of cash. <laughs> so because what I can do is just say you go down one, you go down one, you go down one, you go down one. And then I can just, like, sort this out. There we go. Now we've got all the Winds of Magic we'll ever need. Job is a good one. Alright, I'm going to I'm gonna loot and occupy this. Uh, we'll repair you and repair you. And then what we're going to do... Is we're gonna upgrade you and upgrade you. And I don't have enough money to upgrade you, but we're getting there. It shall be. I probably should have thought that. That actually, that actually stung quite a bit. Uh, I can give us the hidden library. Sure. Salt the garrison. You failed me. Okay, Comet of Cassandora. 
Is this how this character is supposed to work, or is he just bugged? Asking the real questions. Okay, I think I'm going to have to fight this battle, because otherwise I, I just... It, it's probably going to... It says low casualties, but I don't trust it. I don't trust the low casualties, so I'm going to have to fight this battle. But that's going to have to wait until next time. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.